specific Delhi type Sakshi case rerun was averted in Pune by at least two brave youth when a girl was attacked by a friend in an open space during broad daylight even as she ran for help. The entire incident has shaken up not just Pune but entire Maharashtra and has raised questions about public morality, about how despite such an incident happening in a broad daylight, none of the people really came ahead to help the girl. The incident is such that a 20-year-old girl was going with her friend. She was stopped by a friend, Shantanu Zadhav, who was upset that his advances were refused by her. As she ran away, he took off a machete from his bag and ran behind her. The girl ran on the busy streets of Sadashiv Pet, which is in the heart of Pune, in broad daylight, shouting for help. Unfortunately, nobody came ahead to help, even as some bystanders started shooting videos of the incident. As the girl ran, at one point, she fell down on the ground, even as Shantanu raised the machete to attack her. It was at this point that at least two youth who were studying in a nearby library came out after hearing the commotion and ran ahead to save her life. They risked their lives and both of them held Shantanu just at the nick of time when he was about to blow a fatal attack on the girl. Both Harshal Patil and Leshpal Jawalge have been extremely appreciated not just on social media but also by the Women's Commission of Maharashtra for their courage and for saving the girl right in the nick of time. Even as both of them have said that they felt upset that none of the other people who were just mute bystanders came ahead to help the girl even as she shouted and pleaded to everyone to save her life and that they had to stake their life in order to save her even as nobody came ahead. Thereafter, Shantanu was overpowered by a group of men handed over to the Peru Gate police who registered an FIR under section 307 against him. He continues to be in prison even as the girl continues to undergo treatment in a Pune hospital. The mother of the girl has thanked the two men who saved her daughter and has requested that justice be given. But Several questions are being raised on all those mute bystanders who chose not to help and videograph instead.